Well, Frank, you know, I think the crucial argument is that we're living in a free country and we must be free to make our own decisions. After all, government shouldn't be a nursemaid. We don't want the nanny state. Oh, that's very excellent. The only problem is that that is also the argument for legalizing the sale of marijuana, heroin, cocaine, arsenic, and jelly. Or <laughs> well, maybe that's a good idea if we could put a big enough tax on them. <laughs> Politically difficult. Pity. Yes. Got it. When the Prime Minister was Minister for Administrative Affairs, I used to get him to accompany me on regular visits to Lords Wimbledon and Glyndebourne as a guest of BTG. So he's thoroughly implicated in receiving hospitality worth hundreds, possibly thousands from them. Now, if that were to leak, shocking though a leak would be. Oh, shocking, shocking. <laughs> it'd be profoundly embarrassing for the Prime Minister. I can't think why I didn't think of it before. Nor can I. 